by the way, you're balancing on my dashboard and this is, yep, this is happening. Hello, welcome. I decided I wanted to go to the beach and watch the sunset because there is not one cloud in the sky. If you clicked on this video, it's because I'm going to be reacting to some reddits on the on the shower thoughts forum. I couldn't think of what it was. I felt like it would be really boring if that's all I did in this video, so I thought we could go watch the sunset and then you can watch me react to reddits because that's like a full date, right? Like dinner and a movie. Pretty cool. Saw some elk, watched the sunset, almost slid down the cliff that I climbed to watch the sunset. It's so cold though, my hands are like tingly and it's like hurting to bend them. If it sounds like there's explosions happening outside, it's because there is. There is a construction, a construction company across the street building something, but it literally sounds like they're just blowing up the ground. So I'm not saying that this is recommended, but I'm kind of just squatting on the top of my chair. Here's the top, leaning on the back. Will it break during this video? Perhaps. <gasps> it almost just broke, hold on. <laughs> oh, my thighs. Downloaded Reddit today. Gotta keep going with this or I'm gonna forget what I'm doing. Um, and subscribed. I don't know, followed the thread shower thoughts. So I thought, let me lose my Reddit virginity to shower thoughts with everyone. Let's get started. If people can't go to work because it's not safe, then going to work is not safe for work and therefore inappropriate. You, sir, have a good point. Oh shit. At least we don't have to worry about school shootings for a while. I'm uncomfortable. The longer you leave wine unopened, the more you want to leave it unopened. I strongly disagree. The longer I leave wine unopened, the more I want to just open it. I don't know who you are. We're not on the same page about that. Before we get too far into this video, make sure you are subscribed and have turned the bell notification on. And also, if you're not subscribed, following me, if you're not following me, on Instagram, please go ahead and do so. Tristy Poo 1997. I don't know which way is forward for you, but thanks in advance. <laughs> this one just says, you have shit stains inside of you. You know, I didn't want to think about it that way, but girl, your whole insides are a big skid mark. Maybe once we fall asleep, our nipples grow faces and talk to each other. And the reason we wake up during the night or something is because they talk too loud. <laughs> Can you imagine your areolas just growing little faces and are like trying to face each other, like talking shit about you during your sleep. And then one of them like screams too loud and you're like, oh, what's that? And they're like, I only wish. <laughs> when we fart at school, a little piece of our past goes into our classmates' future. I just want to know who's actually thinking about these kinds of things. Shakes my core. <sighs> Fuck. <laughs> Coffins become maracas during earthquakes. No comment. <laughs> At least CO2 emissions are going to plummet. You know, I actually thought about this. I was watching a coronavirus documentary and I think they were in Beijing or something and they were showing like the footage outside and it looked surprisingly clear when they were talking about all the streets being empty. I was really shook just thinking about that. It's like, I don't know, like something like this has to happen for people to realize like how much we're actually polluting things. Cause once all of us aren't leaving our houses, suddenly the air is super clean. Who would have thought, am I right? Blind people can sleep with the light on. Yes. Yes, they can. <laughs> Dating just got exponentially harder with all the business closures. You know, honestly, not that I ever go on dates, but 
is this a time to really want to be going on a date right now? Like, who are you matching with on Tinder? And you're like, yeah, I'm just really bored. Want to go to like Chang's and get some Mongolian food? Like, if that's your thought process, you have some fucked up priorities, honestly. Okay. <sighs> I realized this is like holding a squat position the entire time. Oh my god, my knees. And my knees were like <laughs> just like that. <laughs> Hello, welcome to the seated position of my chair. Glad you could make it. Okay, they're like running out of funny ones, so we're gonna close the laptop and just call that a win for the day. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Let me know like if there's any really juicy Reddit forums you want me to react to, because I want to dive in more but I'd rather do it with you guys instead of like alone by myself. So it's like less awkward if I find something funny and I start like screaming to myself. Well, thank you for, <laughs> thanks champ for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know down below if there's any Reddit forums that you really want me to react to. I'd be happy to do that. Um, and make sure you're subscribed if you're not already. There's an ant on my belly. We love that. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.